the book of Romans chapter 13 verse 1 to 2, the Bible says, Let every soul be subject unto the higher powers, for there is no power but of God. The powers that be are ordained, ordained of God. Whosoever therefore resisted the power, resisted the ordinances of God, and they that resist shall receive to themselves damnation. I want you to take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, I refuse to be arrested by the police in the name of Jesus. Say, I refuse to be arrested by the police in the name of Jesus. Say, I refuse to be arrested by the police in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So by the grace of God, we'll be talking about dream about police. Dream about police. Dreaming of police has become a very popular theme right now. And it is both affecting the men and the women. And most often, many people who usually wake up from this dream about police, they don't really know the spiritual meaning behind it. So for the purpose of this video, I will be telling you the spiritual aspect and the general meaning of dream about police and I'm going to tell you about the dream symbols of other activities so when we are talking about dream about police in a general perspective number one it represents authority just as the Bible says in the book of Roman that we should obey the higher authority number two it represents power number three it represents temptation number four it represents fear number five it represents insecurity Number six, it represents disappointment. Number seven, it represents breaking or obeying the law of the land or obeying the law of your marriage, whatever connotation you want to put at it. Then we are talking about the spiritual aspect, the coco, the spiritual. The spiritual controls the physical. Then, then we are talking about demonic bondage. Then we are talking about strong man then we are talking about agents of darkness then we are talking about opportunity waster then we are talking about spiritual warfare then we are talking about setup at like the spiritual aspect somebody's about to set you up now when you are seeing police in some cases police dream can also just like we have actually pointed out it can represent authority power and some cases it can represent security then seeing police in your dream can represent security depending how you dream about it so when you are talking about when you are talking to police you are talking to police it means that you are you are trying to gain the confidence you are trying to gain the protection of the police maybe you discover that there's there's an insecurity there's an armor going on or somebody just broke the law somebody broke the law or somebody is having a conflict with you or somebody is trying to you know overpower you then you are talking to police that means talking to police at that point in time you are trying to seek for the service of the police to come and investigate a matter praise the living jesus in some cases whereby you are calling the police there's a problem there's if there's an incident something is going on which is beyond your power so you need the authority to come in and rescue you from that situation to rescue you from that area where you cannot help yourself so when you are calling the police it means you are seeking for divine protection you are seeking for divine security praise the living jesus maybe in some cases you saw where somebody is calling police maybe your friend is calling police in that aspect that person is about to set you up Somebody, your friend, is calling the police. Maybe you don't have any matter with that person. But I mean that somebody is trying to set you up. You have to be very, very careful. Calling the police. There's a matter which the police has to come and look into that matter according to the law so that you will not land yourself in court or in prison. You have to be very careful so that you will not engage in any problem that will involve the police, that will involve police. Praise the living Jesus. So, and at the same time, maybe at a time where there's an incident, a very serious incident, fire incident, or any kind of incident, tragedy, calamity, and 
you were trying to reach the police on the phone by email but you discover that you are unable to reach them then it means that there's no help on your way you are trying to get help but the help is not coming forth because the police you are trying to call in that dream represent your messiah represent your destiny helper represent somebody that can take you out from that situation the problem where you are facing but you are unable to reach them it means that problem will overwhelm you it means that, pro that mean, it means there is not going to be solution to that particular situation you find yourself because calling the police it means you are trying to get help from them but when you are unable to reach them it means the road has been closed nobody's ready to assist you out i pray for you the apple of your destiny will not take away his face from you in the name of jesus christ there are some cases whereby you see police chasing you police is chasing you that is insecurity that is fear it could be your enemy it could be an obstacle it could be enemy an agent of darkness trying to capture you trying to arrest you trying to put you in demonic custody it can also be if you are in a, if you are in a problem with somebody and it can be that somebody is about to involve involve that case involve that matter in a police case a policeman is chasing you in your dream you have to be very very careful the way you deal with business the way you involve in shady business fraudulent business you have to be very very careful so that police will not look after you praise the living jesus but when you discover that you are the one chasing the police you are chasing the police in the dream then in that aspect that police you are seeing they are fake policemen when you are seeing fake policemen in the spiritual world they are destiny killers they are trying to kill you and they are trying to destroy you so when you are pursuing them then it means you are trying to overpower you are trying to take away those blockages around your way because some police dream can represent blockages and can represent hindrances praise the living jesus so when you are running away from police you are running away from police you are running away from them then you are trying to escape from trouble you are trying to escape from death you are trying to escape from bondage then you are trying to escape from any any matter that involves the police praise the living jesus maybe you some cases everybody you dream you're in your house you do not have any problem with somebody you all of a sudden you see somebody knocking at your door a policeman is knocking at your door then he's telling you that it's good number one he's telling you that there's a problem trying to come into your life because in some cases some police dream can represent trouble because police they are they are force they are actual they are designated for troubles to tackle to to resolve conflicts and troubles so when police is knocking at your door it means trouble is coming on you trouble is coming to meet you on your way at that point where that policeman is knocking it can also represent attack fear insecurity it can represent disappointment lack lack of loss of control praise the living jesus so when you discover that you have broken the law of your country or you have disobeyed the president or you have dis disobeyed somebody and police is coming knocking at your door it means you're about to be arrested maybe in some cases whereby you have maybe as a driver you drove against the traffic or maybe you are in a business with somebody and and the person told you that is going to arrest you and you dream whereby so police is knocking at your door then it means that that person has already filed a case against you so you have to be very very careful pray that god do not involve me in, into any police case it can also be a false allegation false allegation can happen praise the living jesus maybe in some cases you discover that you you dream where you you dream as a police officer when you dream as a police officer uh, if your love for police is very very deep it can be that god want to connect you to to one of the forces it could be army it could be police navy air force 
it could be that God wants to connect you. It just is maybe the dream is is coming out as a result of your desire to become a police officer. So you have to pray. If your desire is to become a police officer or army, pray that God should grant that request. But if you don't have any desire for it, but you are dreaming of being a police officer, then it's still a good dream. It's still a good dream. It means that then the Lord is protecting you. When you are dreaming of being a police officer, it means the Lord who is a police, then is policing the affairs of your life, in your house, in your matter, in everywhere you go. The police, the spiritual policeman, which is the divine policeman, the angel of the Lord, will encamp you when you are asleep or when you are going away, then it represents protection from evil. Praise the living Jesus. In some cases, this is more common. When you are arrested by the police, this is very serious. When you are arrested by the police, that is demonic bondage. Time waster and opportunity waster. Time delay. Police is arresting you. It means that somebody is trying to pull you down. It means that somebody is trying to lock you up in jail. Maybe there's a matter between you and somebody. And to the extent that that thing has now gotten so serious, gotten to the police desk, the person has reported it to the police. Then that kind of dream is telling you that somebody is about to arrest you. You have to pray that God let that arrest not come to pass. It could be a genuine, maybe you have a connection with somebody. Maybe you as a woman watching me, now a man has been sleeping with you. Later, all of a sudden, the man said, no, I did not sleep with you. And the, the man filed a case against you that he did not sleep with you. So you have to be very, very careful. It's the plan of the enemy to pollute you. Praise the living Jesus. So when you are dreaming where police stop you on your way, that is hindrance. Serious hindrance and stumbling block. You have to cast out that hindrance. At that point, put that police stopping you, they are demonic agents. They are strong man. Strong man manifesting to destroy your, your goals and your dreams. So they are stopping your car. They are trying to put you into the pit of stagnancy. You have to cast those spirits out. Anyone standing at the gate of my bread to die in the name of Jesus. Maybe in some cases, whereby you saw police checking your paper. If police is checking your paper, then it means that they are trying to know if you are going to, if you are a abiding citizen, if you abide by the by the law of the land. Praise the living Jesus. Maybe in some cases, whereby you dream where where you are in a police station, it means that there is a matter that involves the police that is involving you, involving you. So if the matter is so serious, then you have to pray against any satanic arrest, any conflict, any tragedy, any calamity, and any havoc. Praise the living Jesus. Maybe you are fighting the police. If you are fighting the police, it means that you are inviting problem into your life. You are inviting troubles. You are inviting problems that you cannot control. You have to pray that God, whoever that wants to attack me as a result of this dream, Father, attack them in the name of Jesus. Whereby you see yourself, you saw police, looking for you if police is looking for you maybe they have already declared you wanted you are already wanted by the police then you have to pray that any power that is looking for me father disorganize them destroy them in the name of jesus christ and lastly if you dream about fake policemen you dream about fake policemen in your dream they are fake then you have to be very very careful with close enemy betrayer or friendly friend somebody enemy that is trying to come and dupe you and extort you so if you are dealing with you are if you are dealing business with somebody you have to be very very careful and check the profile of that person praise the living jesus so what are the way out the way out is to give your life to christ repent from every nonsense and break break every barrier spiritual barrier on your way and command the strong man of your destiny to die barricade yourself with the blood of jesus christ and and tell god that god i will not involve myself in any police case this year you have to pray that prayer and the lord will help you in jesus name the instruction behind the bible is you take revelation 13 verse 10 isaiah chapter 50 verse 7 to 9 psalm 68 verse 1 joshua chapter 1 verse 5 psalm 27 verse 2 yes you went back on three days prayer and fasting between 6 a.m to 6 p.m Praise the living Jesus. Let us take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, 
I remove myself from the book of troubles in the name of Jesus. See, I remove myself from the book of troubles in the name of Jesus. I remove myself from the book of troubles in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any satanic policeman, any satanic policeman in charge of the affairs of my destiny, any satanic policeman in charge of the affairs of my destiny, die in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Take this last prayer point loud and clear. Say, I want you to shout it very well. Say, every evil man, every evil woman assigned to lay a false allegation against me. Any evil man, any evil woman assigned to lay a false allegation against me. You are a liar. Be destroyed. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So, viewers across the world, I have... At the comment section, you'll be getting more about the prayers. Evangelization.com. I've written the prayers on my website. Take that prayer. I'll put the link at the description so that you can follow that prayer. God bless you once again. Invite your friends and family to subscribe to this channel in Jesus' name. Evangelist Joshua is speaking from Lagos. God bless you.